time, you know, to get into our oh boy. our guests. Come on and sing. Oh, getting no. to know you. Oh, getting no. to know all about you. It's the later, you guys. <laughs> getting to like you. Why are you singing? Getting to hope you <laughs> like me. He's singing. Haven't you noticed? <laughs> Suddenly I'm bright and breeze. What is that? <laughs> because of all the wonderful and new things we're learning about you day by day. Everybody, belated the song. Bad. Deep. Yo, oh, no, no. If I was V, I would be asking, how come you can't give me a song that can got some bouncing, some women, <laughs> some bass? It just some, didn't something. seem to have the feel. You that... know, I always appreciate Mario's voice. Oh, uh, <laughs> chumming up. She's chumming I love up. When he sings <laughs> <to me. laughs> Up. Well, you guys, it's going to be a fun time today. First of all, <laughs> it's time for Sipping the Schmooze. I want you to take a look. This is some of the stuff we had laid up previously, right? Yes. Valena LaSalle, model, actress, photographer. So, you, you know, what happened was we should have put a few more asterisks and listed some more categories because she's a photographer, yeah, uh, talented entrepreneur, uh, a yeah. lot of get up, a person who takes risks, right? Yeah. Uh, always willing to embrace some change. Take a look. Here's a picture. Here's some pictures of her. Yeah, yeah. She she takes risks, especially with that tractor. Yeah. <laughs> <Is> that <true? laughs> Yeah, that tractor is giving me a little problem. I have to like, you know, I have to put my foot on it and say no. You're not going anywhere. <laughs> I'm telling you, take a look, you guys. I know. I'm just gonna scroll you down. So you can see, this is what I talked about her eyes. You can't look at them too long. No, go to sleep. Then she can tell she's taking control. You can go to sleep. You take control go- of you. You have to go to sleep. <laughs> she's all in your head after that, see? So we got to be careful. Only look at this for three to five minutes at a time. There you go. That's all you can do. Man. Everybody, that's our guest, Melena. I'm going to let you take this video. Oh, yeah. So Welcome. Yes, welcome, so welcome, welcome. So happy to be here and so happy to be back. Uh, thank you guys for having me back. <laughs> I just love being here. You guys are just awesome. <laughs> well, we love having you here. With your fine, beautiful you. dress wear and so. stuff. <laughs> I'm a dress girl. I, I just love dresses. Like I'm in dresses all the time. Like wow. You see me in dresses like all day long. You know, wow. you were so you've been smiling. <laughs> She okay. has been smiling, all you all. Day. Since she all has day. been here, yes. it's been a whole, the whole thing's been a up, like since he walked <laughs> through the door. Yeah. Because we were dragging before that, because, you know, it's early sometimes. Well, we had what? the people coming to pick up equipment at the practice show. 8 a.m., that's right. Yeah, that's why, man. So, so you, I'm telling you, so the energy that you see coming through on the on the cameras is real. Yeah. It's really <laughs> real. That That is you. So you've been on a journey. Now, first of all, remind me. Yes. You're from Texas, I thought, right? Yes, I am originally from, from a Texas. small town. Very small town. See, <laughs> see, that's what's so fascinating. She, first of all, it's already been a journey for her. Yeah. Yes. You yeah. know, even to come here, and now she's no longer even in Long Beach. Yeah. No. Now she's in Laguna. Yeah. You know, the zip code and the income Man. bracket just went up. That's <laughs> all. <laughs> Don't you know? <laughs> yeah, that's all different. Yes. Yeah, it went up. So what? Tell us what's been going on now. Cause you had a few things, and we're gonna hit them whatever order you want to hit them in. Cause I'm, you know, we're gonna follow you. But so tell us a little about the journey. What have you been up to of late? Well, the, well, the journey, like the journey continues, and it will forever continue. Um, and that I am proud of, um, cause I'm experiencing some amazing things and meeting wonderful and very amazing people. But um, as far as now, you know, um, I've been getting more, you know, since I'm back, since I'm back now in Cali, you know, I've been getting more into uh, my photography, working on a few projects. And you have wonderful photography. Now, I got your website, too. So we want we can show some of the things if you want to. But yeah, tell us about this. Yes. Um, Vasiliki Studios is the uh, photography company that I own and I shoot. Um, It is all my work. I put my heart and soul into this. Um, so um, a lot of people, <laughs> when they see me, they're like, wait, where's the photographer? Because <laughs> they, you know, um, they're not quite sure what's going on. <laughs> yep. But um, 
And, you know, it's uh, primary shoot fashion, editorial, beauty, commercial work. Um, my work is very clean, crisp, and precise. Um, it is. I'm looking at it. I was going to say clean, and it's, wow. I like I like the models you, you chose. Thank you. I'm very selective. In fact, um, Tuesdays actually sent me, I had my first casting call last week, and it was awesome. Tuesday sent me some beautiful models. Um, it was a very great experience because I'm going to be shooting for some submissions for magazines soon. So wow. I'm going to be um, pushing that. So that's also on the agenda. And that's going to be a journey. Oh, wow. Very, wow. Yes. Very, very exhilarating. Um, well, we've been running. So as you're talking, I'm going to let things show. You know what makes Vic it? Because sort of sweet, switching back it's, and it's, forth. It's so difficult. I can understand why they're going, who's the photographer? <laughs> See, with the part you have to keep saying, I am the photographer. And you are. And people are just not used to that. <laughs> it's just her thing too. Yeah. See, this is what I remember. We talked about more than just eye candy. It's interesting to Vic and I that we actually run into more women entrepreneurs yeah. running their own businesses in the creative world. I'm just amazed by it. It is so skewed. Let me give you an example. We would say about eighty percent of the ones we yeah. run into are women. Yeah. Who are actually doing it and bringing it. Look at this website. Because the style and grace is about all of it. I'm loving it. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. You know, and look, first of all, it, it takes takes a lot of, not only say guts to come back here. Because we do like to flirt with the edge. <laughs> but we believe that people's talent will uh, overcome our little little edginess, if you want to say it. And I still say we're conservative. But this shot, the shots that you're doing, it's the part that they can't get away from. Your eye is part of the whole the whole thing, from your business cards to the layout to your fonts, is simple. You're going, this is a presentation website. That's what it is. Well, that's kind of why we're going to see how critical she is when it comes to hot picks. That's not fair. That's not fair. This is where she wields the sword. That's not fair. You can't say, you know what? That, you can't do that. <laughs> you, th this is a different. Well, you know they take on a different vibe. See, this is where you watch them. See, because right. they all smile till they get to their stuff. Right. Then you watch those eyes start to flash, <laughs> the yeah. brows arch, yeah. and they get serious. <laughs> yeah. I don't know about this one, Mario. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So take a look. I mean, I'm loving this. Wow. There's there. This is very consistent. But ain't all your stuff. Thank you. It is as a man. No, there. It's it's very watchable. <laughs> You're right. It's uh, very watchable. I see a uh, question from Mac Port Town. Mac and Port Town. Oh, you saw. She's all Mac off Port the chat. <laughs> she's all <laughs> off the chat. Oh yes. Uh, the link to my portfolio is vasilikistudios.com or vasilikistudio.com. Um, you can also um, check me out on Facebook. It's facebook.com slash official dot In fact, I just posted an picture up there for everybody because <laughs> i'm going to be going back blonde Woo -hoo. oh yeah yes blonde for the winter and fall dark hair for the summer reversing it up really <laughs> yes yes i think yeah that'd be you know now mac ask is asking you because you know mac is all deep now he's going what type oh, well, of cameras you, you know what you won't believe it but uh i shoot with a i shoot with a rebel i'm very i use very minimum equipment wow so everything's natural light besides my studio shots um which you see with the lovely male model um, that you can see wow. in the preview, yes. Yeah, Simplicity, so, so zen. Yes, sim exactly. You know, Mac is studied at the Sorbonne. He, he did photography. See, Mac is our emeritus right. member. Thank you, Norman. 72. Uh, he peached out a number of album covers, including, you know, one of the first ones for Roy Ayers. Yeah. So he's done a number of, uh, and he came up in the old days. I don't know even how Mac kind of gets the same way. He was taking pictures right. initially and got asked, and then it became a thing. <laughs> oh, she's, you're, Thank you, Norman. <laughs> You know what? See, Valeda's on that. See, you guys. See, now I'm going to tell you chat room, people. Yeah. Valeda's all up in the chat room, I mean, okay? Like, She's what watching. Like, <laughs> what would I look like carrying all this equipment? <laughs> <laughs> it's just to be a, a little bit impossible. Yeah, you so, can't yeah, do it, but no. I, I think, you know, be, the simplicity, um, you can do a lot just being simple. Um, I don't think, you know, photography has nothing to do with equipment. It has to do with, you know, the emotion and your connection with the models and, and um, bring bring forth the emotion and the uh, statement you're trying to make with that particular theme that you're shooting. So I don't think it has anything to do with lights and all that. It's the eye. It's the eye and the yeah. the moment you're trying to create. Yeah. So, well, so because I'm looking at this, like what kind of got you started? I mean, what motivated? How did you start doing photography? Were you, were you already being photographed yourself, and that inspired you, or what? Well, cor um, correct. I was modeling, you know, and I still model. 
um, I, I continue to do that as well. So I'm, I'm doing plenty of things at the same time, mm. which I'm very proud of. Um, but, um, you know, I, I don't know. I always had a thing for it. Um, it's always been something I wanted to do, you know. Um, it's just, I guess it's always been something that's been a part of me. So. Did, did you know, did someone put a camera in your hand or did you one day say, well, I'm going to stop by Best Buy <laughs> <laughs> somewhere and get me a Rebel? I mean, just what was that turning moment when you say, I'm going to buy, buy a camera? Because mm. even a Rebel is an investment. Yes, it is. It is an investment, you know. You know, you got to go in there and plop down something. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yes, indeed. <laughs> um, my first camera was a Minolta. It was a film camera. So I um, started film. And then I switched to digital, but um, um, all my work on my portfolio is digital. So, wow! Because since you know it's quicker format, it's you know, it's the way we do things it, today. It, indeed, it's the way we do things today. But film is always, you know, awesome. Now, what about your blog? Oh yes, I do um, fashion style boards. You know, from time to time. Um, I'll post, you know, um, updates on certain projects that I'm doing, um, you know, try to keep it, you know, stylish for, you know, the girls and gals that check out my, my blog. So, um, yeah, post that link. That'd be awesome. Well, this, you know what? And see, here's the thing. Okay. That edginess to your style. Mm -hmm. which reflects you know even though it's it's it comes still a little you know it's not over it's not over it's not over right. yeah yeah oh, that, yeah yeah, yeah. yeah that, that, well that, just that. like these little these little pants here yeah. i would love to I see you i would love to wear those <laughs> <laughs> I, that today. I, I think you'll really have a cramp then <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, wish, wait a minute, Mario. Yeah. Promises, promises. Yes, yeah, yes. That's all you didn't do. He's, he's <laughs> well, the chat room is loving it. The chat room is loving it. Oh, yeah, they are. They Remember, are. I put I put the link in into the um, into the chat room too, for those people who want to see. They can click on and take a look. Wow. You know, this every you know, it's very hard if you tell something. A lot of people just don't think I. A lot of people really race out, race out as they do it uh, applications and go, the technology will make me better. No, that's not the and case. And that's not, it's a tool. It's always right. been a tool. So the idea that you're doing minimum, because that's exactly what I do. I shoot video with minimum equipment, consumer-based equipment. I don't go high end because I think you have to prove yourself with minimal. Right. And then when you go to the others, then it'll, be, it'll top off. And you know what? It's a selling point. When you go to certain organizations or companies, they want to know what you're doing. It impresses them if you actually have, well, I shoot with this type of a camera. You know, like they say, the bigger the better. Yeah. Well, that's Usually the it, false sense of security. Oh, definitely. Sometimes so. it shocks them. They're like, you did this with a rebel. <laughs> like, <what>? <laughs> <laughs> like, yes, I, and I can't wait till I get my Mark II, so I'm waiting for my upgrade. In fact, I, I, just, I have a T3i now. Ooh, I'm going, you know. I'm moving she's up. T3i. <laughs> she's dropping you, Mario. T3i. <laughs> yes. But, you know, I, I think it's, it's more about the, you know, it has nothing to do with the equipment. It has to do with the, the person behind the lens. Yeah. You know? Well, I know it sure looks special. You, you have a, a look that it speaks. You know, there's a certain consistency in terms of it that's really touching. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah, it's, it's moving. I like the edgy part. And, again, <laughs> your taste in models. Yeah. It's fantastic. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. A lot of beautiful models. Now, Valena was showing me some pictures that she did that are on Facebook. So we're, <laughs> we're testing her out. I told her that we could actually show this desktop if she enlarges the screen over here. Yes. So we can make it, it full screen and she can show you her Facebook. Yes. Yeah, so and you can also see my silly video. <laughs> I want to make that full screen there. All right. Yeah, dude. Now, Vicky, you can show that. <laughs> yes, I'm going to be blonde again. <laughs> I'm up here looking so... I know, Vicky was sitting here. I'm sitting here. No, I was sitting here. I'm, I'm watching you guys. I'm going, I'm not pressing no button. <laughs> oh, oh, you know what? All right. Yeah. <laughs> Let me do this. I'm not going to say anything. And, and V, don't, don't say anything. I want to see if the chat room can feel this photo please chat room <laughs> chat room look at this photo mm. tell me in what word does it make you what what does it make you think okay <laughs> just do that for me real quick and then v will give you the story mm. all right i want to see if anybody says anything look at the story now i want to see if they see what i see <laughs> all right now in the meantime i'll just say how long ago was this shot taken well 
This shot I was taken by Fernando Escobar, a celebrity photographer. Mm -hmm. um, it wasn't too long ago, which makes me decide I want to go back blonde. <laughs> Most definitely. <laughs> Because you know? <laughs> blondes do have more fun. Oh, oh is that true? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Mm. Okay. All right. All right. Okay. So, so okay. I'm going to say this right offhand. You feel that this photo is a little extra. It is a little extra because um, I guess it shows my um, mm. naughty side. <laughs> Because a lot of people no, <laughs> not the naughty <laughs> punishment. Assume the position. <laughs> I guess because a lot of people don't know, I've been um, I have been abstinent for three years, going strong. Say that way, oh. wait, wait, wait. Okay, I need to have so this, this picture is completely contradictory. <laughs> it's yes, it contradicts the entire journey. <laughs> Okay, you. Have but it's it's awesome. It's art. It's photography. It's fun. It it's, is. It's a it's a picture. So it's um you know it plays with the imagination. And I was having a good time. Oh, yeah, the part that well, I love about this Mario, she said a word that now guys are. She said the a word. She said. And what we don't that, hear that. When you hear it, what does it mean? When I hear it, abstinent, <laughs> it means it doesn't. Register. I get a big kiss at the end of the day. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, excuse me. No, Wait. but I'm, no. It was a topic of conversation when she we talked about it. Right. Abstinence, not having, not being sexually active, not that trying to necessarily make a statement to the world, but True. moving forward, right? Right. Because you automatically assume that certain folks, because of their lifestyle, like they assume just because I'm a, surrounded by beauty right. and sexuality, that I would indulge instead of treating my body as the temple that it is. But well, you too, Valena. Yeah. Well, let me get let <laughs> let me let V read Max Port Townsend's take on the photo. Okay. So read what he says. The photo is communicating to him. <laughs> you were under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. <laughs> I can strip search you anytime. <laughs> That's okay. So you All see. Right. I so, see. I see. So so is the photo supposed to elicit that type of response? Um, I mean. I know. Uh, it's, yes, it's, I mean, I mean, it is. It's too. Uh, but I mean, again, that's the whole creative aspects of photography. It's supposed to create an imagine. You know, it's supposed to ignite that imagination within the person. What do women but think of it? Then? It doesn't reflect that. That's how the person yes. is. You know what I mean? It, it, it's you know that's the general perception that everyone creates for themselves. You can't. You know what I mean? All right. Um, but I can't say that that's not a side of me. You right. know because I wouldn't have, have never done it. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's part of the mystery, right? The mystery is the imagination. I, know. I mean, I mean, I love this part. I, I'm <laughs> with. I'm with. Valena, and still, when you watch her pictures, you imagine her. Right. That there's no question. That's part of the mystery. You look at her, and you can look at your smile. <laughs> then you look at the picture, and you do imagine. Yeah. But that's the mystery of people, right? Right. Yes, it, indeed. It's, the it's, it's one of the lovely it, things about living. <laughs> we have we have a rough time being overt about what's being said underneath <laughs> and aesthetically. Yeah. Norman, I mean, a PMC said sexy, and imagine what could be. Now, in, in many ways, people go, no, you're not supposed to read into that that way. It's supposed to be art. I said, okay, I'm looking at it. Beautiful art. Now, imagine what could be. See, it's one of those things that it is what it is. At right. the end of the day, we need to be more accepting of what the messages are and just don't assume the person reflects right. that. The message is what their that person wants it to mean to them. Right. I think it's art, and I think people should ex accept the idea that our sex is part of who our human nature is. I completely agree with that. It just reminds me of like I call it the Marilyn Monroe concept. Yeah. yeah. You know what I mean? Like yeah. she was this, you know, delicate person who was turned into this, you know, sex icon, but. That wasn't really who she was. That's right. You know what I mean? Um, but the perception of her, you know, killed herself. That's killed, right. killed her so so bad internal that it, it just affected her in such a large way. Yeah. You know what I mean? Because everybody perceived her in just... Perceived. Yes, the perception Just was, like you, right? <laughs> I mean, because, you know, notice now, now see, Belena's complex. You know right. she's sensual because yeah. you can see her work. Yeah. But she said abstinent. Right. Yeah. But you know she's sensual, and she's definitely a woman, and celebrates and is comfortable yes. in her own skin. That's one of the things about her that I like too. She is comfortable with who she is. 
So is that a conflict? Tell, always tell them why it's not a conflict then, Belena. It's, well, I mean, for me, it's not a conflict. <laughs> right. I have, um, because, you know, I, you know, I'm learning a lot about myself being abstinent. Um, you know, I feel that, you know, I'm, I'm growing more, more sexual. <laughs> in a sense. Take, <laughs> take, <laughs> take, take, fight that one. <laughs> You know, but I'm I'm learning a lot more about myself and you know my needs, my wants, my desires. And yes, I think um, being absent helps you, you know, learn to be more comfortable with yourself. Yeah. And um, grow as a strong and sexual individual. <laughs> <laughs> love it. Tuesday. I love what Tuesday. Has. What did she say? Tuesday said, "Is there a reason behind Valena being absent for three years?" Inquiring minds want to know. <laughs> Abstinence is a high octane liquor or liquor. Now. Oh. There you go. She don't put you on blast. You know you good Tuesday. Yes, yes. You you good. You good. Well, <laughs> we try to look at the chat. <laughs> try to look at see what, try to look and see what I was right. <laughs> no, but they cut the app. They all t- grab, took a run on that abstinence. That's right. <laughs> what is it? What they got to the talk about abstinence? I think there's so much sugar in us coffee. That way. <laughs> What see they want to know? Everybody says you do something. We all do something. Right. But what's the real motivation? That, you know, uh, to say this right. isn't this true? And you guys can correct me if I'm wrong. You're in a wonderful relationship. It was beautiful. It may have ended in an awkward way, but you left on a high. Do you push to be abstinent? I I say no. Mm-hmm. If you leave out of what they call relationships that were questionable, people you're running into. Mm-hmm. You're being objectified, all these other things. Then I see that as a reason that people push towards. But I've never seen nobody who was happy from one go, you know, I was so happy, I'm going to go abstinent. So what's the motivation? <laughs> uh, that I have to leave to speculation. <laughs> well, <laughs> it can saying. be a positive weight now. Because it can be, in other words, let's say you have a breakup. Typically, you tend to be angry. Okay, and so... I remember, at least with my last one, I just told myself, let's not be angry. Let's not be angry and let's not protect ourselves. So one thing I didn't want to go do was immediately in the past, when I would break up, I would drown my sorrows in a sea of sex. <laughs> if, I was bra- if I broke wait, up, wait, if I broke up, <laughs> and it was back then, you know, the day you could, you could get, in other wow. words, back then, if I broke up on a Wednesday, I went out on a date Thursday, Friday, Saturday, wow. Sunday, Monday. <laughs> okay, like I hit the street with a vengeance, right? You see what you I, If I broke up, I was, I filled up the car, <laughs> go to the bank, it's time to get rolling. <laughs> Nowadays, see, with elevation, though, you don't necessarily do those same kinds of things. Many of us make some of our worst decisions. Right at the time of a breakup, right? That's when you make this, you sleep with the wrong people because you need some affection, you need some love, (laughs) you need somebody to hold you, you know, and guys, you know, we do it too. So that's when you make these bad decisions. So I think as we mature, stepping back Mm -hmm. does do that. You know, it doesn't have to be a rebellion. Like like I did it too. Remember, we were talking about that on the show, right? We were saying, Mario needs a woman. Even though I insisted. (laughs) That it was allowing me to save money. I was doing a lot of repairs money. around the house. That's all he cares about is money. Get better sleep. Well, money does. Bathroom yeah. was clean. Didn't have nothing hanging up in the bathroom but a towel. No undies. No. He's <laughs> wrong. It's the wrong impression. You're sending a mess. We should call this the Mario reflection hour. Well, Valena made okay. me reflect because you know, and she's beautiful. But you know, like I said, you can still get the the, the idea that her head's in the right place. Oh yeah, it is. It's definitely. I just think mm-hmm. I think people always, you know what? I'll say this. No, I'll say this. This is interesting because Mario and I was talking about this earlier. I said when people have it in their mind what they think you are, try to go tell them something. You're just saying, I'm not doing this anymore. Oh yeah, right. And see if they really sit there and believe you. They right. won't believe you if you say, you know, I'm. I'm not dating. I haven't dated nobody for six months. And he says, "You're a man, right, Victor? Yeah, you're single. Yeah, and so you're you're lying your ass off to me, right? That's how people. Because most men are only as good as their opportunities, you're right? <laughs> yeah, that's right. So you see, they're only as good as the hey, opportunities that pre- present themselves. <laughs> Wait a minute. Go so on. and you know, like I said, if the right person walked up and said the right things, it was over. You know, end of quest. <laughs> quote. You have to quote Norman. You have to. 
What does he say? <laughs> so he said, Norman, 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 I don't need a man. I can live without one. With or without one. Norman. <laughs> PMC said he's absent due to men on pause. <laughs> Mac is telling us how he's never used Viagra. Okay, you know what? He says Ben Gay. <laughs> this is this 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 is this is our chat room V. I'm just letting you know. Well, because you know, I know I'm, I'm reading this. I love it. I love there's it. more absence going around than people talk about, yeah. right? Yes, and yes. it's and hopefully for positive reasons, I, right? I've met a, a lot of people that are also, you know, withholding, and I think it's a good thing, and I think that more people should, you know, express it and say that they're doing it. It's, mm -hmm. You know, it's it's not something to be ashamed of. You mm -mm. should definitely be proud of it. I mean, bring some over here <laughs> after about a month in. Yeah. <laughs> We're, we're the new Tell rage. Come on by. We're the new rage now. After this comes out of the closet, we just want to talk about it. Say, <laughs> so, hey, let's talk about what we're not doing. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Make it good. This is terrible. Well, everybody, you know, take a look because she's got stuff. We want you to be aware because <laughs> we want you to come to Vasiliki Studio. Yes, indeed. Where does where does the where does the name come from? Vasiliki is Greek, and um, it means queen. Oh, queen. Yes. And oh. I'm not. I didn't name it that because I I feel like I'm a queen, but I named it that because you know I I want when people shoot with me, I want them to experience, um, you know, how can I say it, the treatment of like royalty, huh? Somewhat, you know what I mean? Like you know, it just expresses the quality of the work that I want to produce. Right. You know. Well, I love it. Yeah. I love I love the sensitivity to it. Yeah. Well, everybody, where's my sound effects? <laughs> when you need them, right? <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to do that. That's yeah. my co-host. Yes. Blaine LaSalle. We're yeah. going to be coming back. Get more features. All her stuff. A lot of photos. All that photography. Man, just take Man. a look. You guys, VasilikiStudio.com. Yeah. yeah. She's on Facebook. She's on Twitter. Yes, I am. She's all that stuff. You know, I, she's another one of those people that we always say she's a perfect fit in that television. Yeah, she is. Except she'll drive herself crazy with her sense of fashion, see, and her perfectionism. See, it's going to dry and will drive her. <laughs> I'm going to tell her, it's okay, baby, it's okay. But Mara, I, wanted to, I know you do. Oh, well, I'm down to earth. I'm more down to earth. Yeah, but, you know, but look at your stuff. It's so perfect. You oh, know what I'm saying? You. It is. It is, though. Yep. You know, so we know that it's going to be like that. Thank you. Wow. Thank you.